We have a news alert for you tonight. More than 10,000 Westar customers are without power in Sedgwick County. Westar says the extreme heat is to blame and they are working to fix the problem. Now, here is the map of the primary areas affected. Boy, it is a scorcher out there today, so much so that we set a record high in Wichita by mid-afternoon. People across the city were out today finding ways to enjoy the day or just beat the heat. Kicks Brian Ramsdale has our big story. Well, we did it. Whether you like it or not, Wichita shattered the old record from 51 years ago and crashed into the century mark. It is pretty hot. <laughs> This is the earliest we've ever officially seen 100 degrees in Wichita since the records have been kept. The previous 100 degree temperature record was on May 9th. So, maybe you're thinking a little water relaxation would do you well. It's not that cold because it's hot. It's warm. Well, it sounds like even those brave enough to swim in the Arkansas River can't get away from the heat. But there are a few out there that really aren't complaining. Since we've been having so many snowstorms, I'm kind of enjoying the weather. Rosie Vaquera and Darwin Obando were out for a walk near the new water fountain in downtown Wichita, thinking about the temperatures just a few days ago and then the shock today. It's pretty odd. Uh, it was like 30 degrees last week, you know, now it's about to hit 100. And all that wind that we love to complain about, well, maybe it's doing us a favor today. The wind kind of makes it a, a breeze, so it makes it a little bit cooler. Not doing us a favor is the lack of rain. With 100 degree temperatures and no substantial precipitation, parts of south central Kansas and the state are now ranked as being in extreme drought. Not good news to farmers, gardeners, or anyone who enjoys a little bit of rain. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy weather out here. You never know what to expect. Brian Ramsdale, Cake News.